that. That was a tremendous play. What did you see in that pass breakup? Um, I just saw, you know, we were, we were thinking about it. We were looking at it all week. You know, they love to go to the check down. So I was just keep my head in the swivel and just doing what I need to do. Defensively, you guys held them to just one touchdown after intermission. What was the key defensively in the second half? Uh, just executing. Uh, that, 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 you know, we, we were working on that all week. Um, you know, we're trying to build our confidence throughout the week and just, you know, understand that, that we're going out there together and then stay poised and just go out there and execute. With the uh, adversity you guys have gone through the last week, some of the losses, how much extra special was this win to have, have that moment to, to show that you guys can win a game like this at home? Um, I just think it just goes to show who we are. You know, um, in the past uh, games this, this year, you know, we showed that uh, we, we beat ourselves, but, you know, we could come out here and, you know, play a tough opponent and go out there and get a W. Loxley said that you guys grew up before our eyes today. Would you say you agree with that statement? Is that, do you guys feel like you had a big moment of growth today as a team? Oh, 100%. I feel like every game is growth. Um, you know, we can always learn from something. We're going to learn a lot from this game and, you know, get prepared for next week. What was it like when Billy scored that touchdown on the sideline? Man, I, that, I was ready for that. <laughs> That's really what just Billy does. I just know I, once I seen him pull that ball, ooh, I know he was getting in there. When you hit him, did you know that the ball was out, or did it kind of take you a little bit to like look around and see if you caught it? Uh, I was definitely a little bit confused. Um, <laughs> you know, I was looking around, and then I see my teammates started running, and you know, it was just a blessed feeling. You know, and when the fans poured out for you to be a part of the field rush, how does that feel? Like, take me through a player's emotions when that's all happening. Man, um, I just feel like it was just a lot of emotions. I was like, all right, know where to begin. Um, I really wanted to celebrate with my teammates, you know, um, you know, get back in the locker room, you know, and just enjoy that, you know, sing the song, go up there, get the water flying around. Like, <laughs> that's the part I look for. Caleb, when LeVan picks that ball off and gets like a big return like that, what's that do for you guys as a team just to know you have the confidence that, yeah, we, have, we finally have the momentum to make this comeback now? Oh, it's huge, huge, huge play of the game. Um, I just say it just goes back, you know, like that's that's just what we do. And like, we know that we can execute that on a weekly basis and, you know, just to build off that. And that just helped us, you know, to, to win tonight. What was going through your head on the field goal block and then of course the following the ladder was to make sure big time? Get a block, get a block, that's it. I was trying to block for my teammate, man. We, I think we gotta go down there and score. So, yeah. Caleb, there's been a lot of criticism about the defense. Do you feel like this was vindication for you guys, holding them to seven points only in the second half? Yeah, um, you know, I just feel like uh, we come together and, you know, we, we, we really bond even on and off the field. And I wish, and I think that, like, helps us, you know, go out there and execute to a level that we're, to where we can, you know, get a win like how we did tonight. What about this one? What does it mean for you guys after having two straight losses and, you know, people getting a lot of negative around here? Um, just a win, man. We just <laughs> like you know. I just I just look at it as, as another opportunity. You know, the Lord blesses us with opportunities, just like how we how he did today. You know what I'm saying? So it's just trusting in him and just you know relying on what he's he set uh, forth for us. Did you feel like Levine Scruggs' interception was kind of the turning point for you guys? I feel like we had a lot of turning points. I feel like that was a big big moment in the game. But I also think that we as a collective that we had big moments to where it helped us get the W. What was it like playing USC? I'm sure you've seen him play on television and have him actually show up in college for Just another game. When you're walking up behind him on that final play, you could almost, I could feel you launching yourself into him from the press box. Like, if you're, you're just like, I've got to give everything I can here to break this play up and make sure it's incomplete. 100%. I, uh, that's, that, that's kind of my mindset going into everything, even on and off the field. Talked about during that field rush one to get in there and celebrate with your teammates. What was that actual moment like when you guys got to all celebrate in the locker room together? I never seen so much water in the <laughs> locker room before. Um, make sure we do our part in cleaning it up, um, making sure you know we help out the janitors because you know they're our family too. And uh, yeah, it was just it was just fun, man. Yeah, what's next for you? How do you take this win and this experience? What's next for you? Uh, it's next for me. Um, I'm going to trust in the Lord, and, uh, you know, we're going to take what our mistakes was from this game and build off that, and we're on to the next.